what a handball party we witnessed in Budapest. The fans delivered a fantastic atmosphere, and Sandra Zoloshi Zakshik added her two cents as well. 11 goals in a 36 23 win against Fleury Loret would cap off an incredible individual performance. Her movement and vision for the game combine effortlessly with her precise shooting, which is always clinical and difficult to read for the goalie. The 25-year-old gave her best display so far this season and celebrates her first appearance in our three stars. Katarina Bolatovic continues her snowballing good form by scoring eight goals against Lublin, her biggest total so far this season. In the last round of the group stage, she seemed to score at will. It's always important for Budućnost's back row to do their job and enable easy goals to be scored. Her lethal partnership with Niagu has already produced an astonishing 75 goals this campaign, making them the second and third highest scorers in the competition. Every team in the Women's EHF Champions League knows that if they want to achieve anything, it will have to include getting past Buruchnos first. They're favorites to win the title again, and it's easy to see why with Bolatovic impressing on the courts. When the going gets tough, the tough get going. Nora Merck is back with a bang playing yet another outstanding game. In the match against Bayamare, there were important points up for grabs to take into the main round. Points which Merck helped secure for her team with a total of 11 goals. It's always fascinating to see her dynamism in one-on-one -on -one situations. Always a threat no matter her position, she never gives up on any ball and always fights with the heart of a lioness. Whether it's from the 7-meter line, from the back row or from 6 meters out, Nora Merck is always extremely dangerous, cool as a cucumber and is slowly becoming a regular face in our three stars.